Well, many of us will be finishing up our holiday shopping this week, and while you're out shopping, think about grabbing an extra toy and donating it to Toys for Tots. I got to start my shopping. I haven't even started. <laughs> got yet. a ways to go. You can drop off an unwrapped toy at any Metro Atlanta Public's grocery store. Volunteers will then take them to Toys for Tots, the warehouses like the one in Henry County, where Fox 5's Marissa Mitchell is live there at the warehouse. And Marissa, the warehouse is ready for all of those toys to start flooding in. Oh yes, just bring the toys. You can get a lot of ideas too for shopping. Take a look. We have several volunteers here from Home Depot. They are sorting through the boxes and I'm kind of reliving my childhood as I go through here. Candyland was actually one of my favorite games growing up. Actually, I, I still play it, but that's just a secret between us. But they've been out here for quite some time sorting through the toys and what we're trying to do is to collect toys for children in need across the metro area. And what's Christmas? What are toys without the man of the hour, Santa? He's here on site. And he told me I made the nice list this year. Oh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> you were on the nice list. Yep. yep awesome. Yep. Now, tell me, uh, Santa, what, what do we need? We have a lot of toys here, yep. but we are in need of some for specific ages. Oh, absolutely. And I'll tell you what, this box right here explains it all. If you, mm. This is the uh, boys 11 and up box. And uh, we're really short on those uh, all the way down the line. So boys, uh, sports equipment, um, You'd see uh, games, that kind of thing, uh, anything electronic, uh, remote cars, that kind of thing. That's what we need. And so. I know just about 30 minutes ago, we had several officers from the Georgia Department oh, yeah. of Public Safety. Yeah. We want to roll that video for you here. They showed up with lots Absolutely. of toys, including toys for boys. Absolutely. Not only did they bring toys, but they also brought a check for more than $21,000 yeah, to amazing. help purchase more toys for children across our area. And of course, we have the Marines here, Sergeant Holcomb. Talk about why it's so important to give back, particularly to time of year this time of the year for me at least especially before all marines it's knowing the fact that there's going to be a child wake up or even you know an older child teenager or something like that wake up and actually have something to receive from family members and things like that and the folks from the good folks from home depot and a lot of other people outside of that have really just stepped up and done their part this year. It's amazing. It's wonderful. Yeah, and just to see so many volunteers come through today with smiles on their faces. It feels good to give and know that you're you're helping families. And now you can come uh, to the warehouse, but you can also donate at your public store. Uh, all public stores up through December 23rd. Yes, there are boxes there. You can put toys in there. And I actually brought a, a toy, but I'll show that uh, on the news at 6. One of my favorite toys to donate. Nate. So thank you all uh, so much for joining us. Thank you, Santa, also Absolutely. for making sure I'm on the nice list this Absolutely. year. Absolutely. And please give. It's so much fun. Back to you. All right, Marissa, put a good word in for me with Santa, will you? <laughs> Again, there is plenty of time for you to help with Toys for Tots. Just drop off a new unwrapped toy at any Metro Atlanta Public's grocery store now through Sunday. Sine.